Well now this is my second Blender tutorial video. This one's gonna be about keyframes. This is your default window and again I'm gonna I'm gonna go to scripting and instead I wanna have this for timeline because it's very useful. Um, can I bring it down so you can see sometimes maybe a, a bit of Python commands and what you need now is a new file and as usual you need to import PPY. And keyframes are used if you don't know to animate objects like I can change location, rotation, scale, uh, colors, anything so first thing I want to do is add comments so my code is a bit easier to read what I'm going to do first is bring the cube up and down so I need to add a keyframe at frame 1 this one is just at its basic location where it comes at first. This is the name of your object. You can change it if it's sphere or anything. Okay, keyframe, keyframe insert. Then you have to choose choose data path. Uh, this is like location, rotation order, scale, uh, anything. Okay, and frame one. Then I'm gonna do it. Oops, for other frames too. Okay. Now what I want to do is translate the cube. So the way to do it is to translate like this. The value you can uh, you can also just change the location. It's the same thing. I want to bring it up, so I'm gonna bring it up five and then down and it should work unless I made something wrong run a script okay and if I test it see it goes up and down so next one I want to do is rotation instead okay how you do it is it's called rotation order instead of location So how you do it is, this is always the object you, you have selected, or the object, and then rotation order 0, it can be 0, 1, 2, it's basically x, y, z. See, if I change it, you'll see 0 equals a bunch of numbers, 1, 2, and if I'm, I put 180, it's basically pi, and 360, see pi times 2 so the first one is just 0 and that what's going to happen is the cube is going to go up and spin uh, nine. okay should work You see. So it's the same thing for scale. If I bring it like this, just need to copy. It's very fast uh, in that case. Uh, scale one is the default scale when you add a cube, for instance, or a sphere, anything. And two is just twice the size. Uh, I'd like to to make it for x, y, and z. Okay, two. Okay, it should work. So you see the cube gets bigger. So you can do this with colors and see if if you want to play around. Okay, it's just a simple tutorial about this. So next time I think I'm gonna show you a bit about how to use maths so see ya